Okay, so one of the things I like to do whenever I'm out and about is try and find cool diners. My dad calls them joints. Uh, and I have some time as I'm going to my uh, state park today. So I decided to stop off because I saw this place. It's called Rudy's Diner. It's in Brilliant. Uh, and I thought, you know what? This looks kind of funky. Let's check it out. Need to eat something. Um, this is going to be a little weird though, but I won't lie because this is the first time I've eaten in a restaurant and maybe a year and some change. Uh, I am fully vaccinated. I'll carry a mask just in case. Uh, but it's interesting to get back out there and start doing things again. So uh, Rudy's Diner, we're going to check it out, see how it goes. Uh, who knows? Maybe this will be a spot that I uh, recommend. So this really is an old school diner. There's a counter here and um, benches. Looks like that would be a cool place to sit too. Um, I don't know, feels like it hasn't been touched in about 40 years. Let's see how good the food is though. Coffee's not bad. It's definitely a old school vibe here. Hopefully it'll be good. Okay, so this is how I like my food. This is great looking diner food. Hope it tastes as good as it looks. Tastes like good diner food. My dad would love this place. So the eggs were good. Now it's time to check out the waffle. It looks excellent. It's just the way I love my diner waffles. Nice, light. Crispy, let's eat this bad boy. So I gotta tell you, Rudy's Diner, very good food, great diner food. Thumbs up on that. So Rudy's Diner turned out to be really, really good, classic American diner food. If you're ever in Brilliant going around here, you wanna stop by if you like classic American diner food. Uh, when I was talking to the waiter, he told me Rudy uh, started this back in 1939 uh, and uh, it's changed ownership a couple of times, but they still use the name. Just kind of a cool vibe. Uh, one of the nice things about uh, car camping, uh, being able to make these quick little pit stops along the way. 
Hey, that's going to do it right now for me. Make sure you follow me all over social media at RV Jedi. And then, of course, you can follow me on the blog at RVJedi.com. Hey, when you get a chance, explore these kind of joints uh, wherever you are. These small mom and pop places really uh, need the support from everybody. And uh, you know what? It's really good food. You might find out that you like a classic American diner no matter where you are. We'll see you next time.